Welcome to Poitra Laptop Care. See the type C. The fact of types uh, type C I am going to explain today. Hmm? What is that fact? In practically, so what will be the voltage in type C? When you connect the type C charger, what will be the voltage and how it will convert as 20 volts? So practically we can check. Huh? We will check. Okay. See, I will show you. First, if you connect type C charger, then the pin number 4. What is that? Here, 1, 2, 3, 4. 4 and just a minute. 4 and 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. 4 and 9, both are same. In both side, in both connector, you will get voltage. What voltage you will get once it connects the type C? So let us check. See, I am going to connect now. So multimeter is there. Now I am going to connect. See, immediately what voltage it will come. See, here I am checking. The voltage is 20 volts. Okay. See, all of a sudden it became 5 volts. Here also the same thing. See, 5 volts. Once again, I will show you, I will disconnect the charger and again I will show you, see the multimeter, I will check first, see here and I will connect this one. See, initially it will be 20 volts so immediately it will become as 5 volts see how it's turning on turning to 5 volts now it's a 20 now immediately 5 okay this is the reality of type c so type c always it won't be 20 volts so immediately it will turn to 5 volts hmm? now this 5 volts where it will come as usual yesterday what i explained it will come to this coil See this coil, what the voltage? Coil voltage is 4.5, uh, it's a 5 volts. Okay, the output also 5 volts. Now, where it will come? It will come to MOSFETs. Same thing yesterday, which I uh, told you, know, explained you know. So same thing, that's actually normal adapter. Now it's a type C, in type C, the first and second MOSFET, sorry, uh, the charging IC MOSFETs, dual MOSFETs, so what is the result? See, it will come to PR700. What voltage will come? We'll check. See, here it's a five volts. What voltage? 5 volts here coil also has 5 volts then here is the input and here is the output hmm? the output voltage this coil this coil voltage is see 5 volts it means it will come from here this coil 5 volts it will, uh, it will come and here it's a Q1 and Q2 both will bypass this voltage. It won't do anything. Hmm? What is the gate then? See, gate will be 10 volts. Means it is in off condition. Half in the sense it will bypass, I think. So, same thing. Right? Here, here, here. Hmm. Oh, I can't check this one. Okay. This one is drain 5 volts. 10 volts it means it's bypassing correct okay anyway it's what it doing it's bypassing directly it acts as a normal mosfets but high low mosfet is not there in this so first the 5 volts will come now that one it's bypassing to this this coil this coil has 5 volts now it will come to another 
high low MOSFET. It's a what is that? This one is dual MOSFET. Dual MOSFET input has five volts. What about output? See here, output has eight point six one volts. Here actually Q three Q four is acting as a boost converter. It means it's a P four is working. See. 8.61 8.61 for what this is output to the motherboard okay this is how 5 volts is converting as 20 volts but when it will convert once you power it on see what i'm doing is uh, again i'll come to the pr 700 pr 700 here what is the voltage 5 volts you are getting now what i am going to do is i will turn it on just a minute this side easily you can and if I will turn it on it's very carefully you have to do otherwise it will be problem hmm? okay see now power button is here what I am going to do is I will check this coil it is this coil this coil output will be 5 volts see the 5 volts now i am going to turn on see the output is 5 volts now i am going to turn it on see i am going to press the power button see what the voltage you are getting 20 volts it means when you turn it on then only you will get the voltage see the output is 20 volts got my point so when you press the power button then only you will get the voltage what voltage 20 volts so that's it see this is the diode diode input or output whatever it may be it's a 20 volts once you press the power button okay now it's a conclusion what is that first initially it will check the 20 volts okay when it's not turned on then it will convert to 5 volts again but the output it will give 8 volts what required voltage is there that voltage it will give but the main thing is once you press the power button then only here you will get 20 volts otherwise it will become 5 volts that is the truth here okay this function will do through the pdic okay please keep it in your mind this function through the pdic it will do but the charging ic section nothing is there here so first the 5 volts will boost the second MOSFET is there now that high low MOSFET the dual MOSFET that one the functionality will be boost the 5 volts to 20 volts no not 20 volts it's 8 point something volts okay that's it that is the truth of type C hmm? if you have any doubts please put it in comment box if possible I'll give the answer thank you thank you very much